Assalamu alaikum students this is your english language teacher and again we are starting chapter number 3 but the topic uh, for today's lesson is favorite fictional places right so which is your favorite fictional place students have you ever think about it okay so um, okay just you think and meanwhile and just have a look of the objectives for this lesson after reading this lesson we will be able to describe the favorite place to critically comprehend and select descriptive adjectives for better description of the place right and uh, lastly uh, you would be able to enhance and evaluate the location and personal opinion regarding that place right Okay so first of all before moving forward students we have to just think about uh, the definition uh, like uh, what is a fictional place just think for a while what is a fictional place and have you ever thought about your favorite uh, fictional place which is your favorite fictional place um okay All right. So uh, just now, uh, firstly, I have a look of the definition. Fictional locations are actually places that exist only in fiction and not in reality. Right? These pictures have no concern. Sorry, these places, the fictional places, have no concern with the. reality they just exist in our imagination they just exist in novels in fictions in movies right uh, for example nega verse or planet x these are not uh, places uh, that exist in reality but these are the fictional places okay so how we can describe our favorite fictional place mm hmm Okay, we can use different words, different adjectives. All right, what else? Oh yes, we can uh, follow as a a set of instructions, as a a certain sort of points to while describing a picture. All right, and then have a look of these points and have a look of these ob uh, adjectives here one by one. Okay. Okay, let's move on. Adjectives to describe a place. What are the adjectives that we can use while describing a place or our fictional, uh, our favorite fictional place? Okay, here we have them. First one is ancient or historic. Second is beautiful, boring, busy, charming, crowded, huge. fascinating polluted gothic mysterious okay okay so such sort of places that looks like this uh, that are uh, you know tattered and that are old these places are called ancient places what else beautiful place Okay, here you can see that you can uh, tell, you can describe this place in a single word. That this is a beautiful place. Okay, this is boring place. The deserted land, the dark area. All right. What else? Busy place where people are busy in different activities. Okay. and here you can see a charming place all right how you can describe this place with what sort of place it is yes this is a crowded place because there are a large number of people involved you can see a large number of people here gathered at the same time at a specific place this is a crowded place okay so what sort of place it is yes this is a huge place 
because this is vast right how would you describe this place yes this is very fascinating okay and what is this yes this is a factory area industrial area right so here you can see a lot of a large number of you know smoke is there we can see all the garbage or other sort of things all around so this such sort of place is a polluted place okay so this is very this is what gothic place because it's mysterious it's dark it's like uh, on a deserted land you we are if we start living here we would be alone here right so uh, alone at a distant place distant from the city area from urban life okay so this sort of place this is scary right so this sort of place is called a gothic place okay what is this yes this is a mysterious place that uh, such sort of place that inculcate uh, something uh, you know new something different and that compel you to think about it to attend it and uh, to have a side of it attentively such sort of place is called a mysterious place okay so students now you need to choose which is your favorite place your favorite fictional place would it be huge would it be fascinating would it be crowded would it be charming how you would describe and how you would select your uh, favorite fictional place and after selecting your favorite fictional place you need to write a descriptive essay on it but before writing you need to keep in mind these points these are the important points to consider to keep uh, that should be kept in mind while describing a fictional place where first of all you need to tell that where is it located on the earth or in the mars or in any other uh, planet or anywhere else we you, you can because this is you know the, uh, the fictional place is what it doesn't exist uh, in the reality it doesn't have any concern with the reality it just exists in the fictions in your imagination right so uh, first of all we need to tell that where our fictional place is located okay then what describe its interior and exterior either is it uh, either it is huge from inside uh, are there pillars what sort of floor it has what sort of material is used uh, what sort of carvings are there inside the building right and what is its exterior what is the nature of its exterior how it looks like okay so uh, then what is important and worth rem remembering about this place then you need to tell that when it was constructed okay then why why it is your favorite how it got famous then lastly and uh, you need to tell that how it got famous right and uh, you also at the end of the essay while describing the whole building while describing the whole place at the end you need to add your own opinion what is your opinion how this place can be changed how uh, you can add something new in it uh, right and what is your opinion your suggestion your feelings uh, your emotions that are attached to this place why you feel so comfortable why you feel so you know uh, charming while uh, thinking about that place or while visiting that place such sort of things right okay so this is your home task that write down a descriptive essay on your favorite fictional place and keep in mind the previous points while writing these points and uh, you can select one of uh, these places from here okay all right 
so students uh, what uh, we have learned so far in this lesson uh, what is a fictional place secondly what are the adjectives to describe a place and thirdly the points that should be kept in mind while describing a place right okay still you have any problem or difficulty in your task you can ask me thank you very much good luck take care allah hafiz